Hey there, I am Craig from Cloudflare, and I am so excited to have you at this hackathon. We are really excited to have you here. You might be wondering, why is Cloudflare at a hackathon? And that's because maybe you don't know that we have a developer platform that is very fast to build on, and it's actually ideal for prototyping. And in fact, for this hackathon specifically, this is, we have the platform for building agents. So uh, agents.cloudflare.com. Uh, head over here, check this out. I'm gonna give you a whole bunch of links uh, in, a, in a repo when this is all done. So don't, so don't worry about taking notes right now. So, so we have the platform for building agents. It's a wonderful place. It's fun to build. It's really quick and you can deploy them uh, very easily. Very, you don't even choose any reason. You just kind of do NPM run deploy and there you go. So uh, alongside that, we also have an MCP server and it's even easier than that. You press this button this deploy to Cloudflare button, and you get yourself an MCP server. Now, if you haven't worked with MP MCP servers before, that's model context protocol, and that's going to allow you to, in English, control a sort of API. So let's take a look at what one of those uh, looks like. This is the code after I deploy that, I, I push this. Let's take a look at that real quick here. So uh, the tool comes in and it has, you know, of course, has your ad and you take an A and a B and you add them together, you return it, you return the content. And then that allows any sort of uh, agentic software. A lot of people are using this locally on their, on their machines, but you can also host this on a server and it's really easy to do. In fact, if I just do this NPM run deploy, what's gonna happen is it's gonna take that and it's gonna put it up on the server. So now I can connect to that over the server. I can connect to any place that I need to. And uh, one of the things that's really nice about that is I've got, so now I've got this URL, right? And that URL now can go and control. Um, I added a function here, right? I added this new tool. So server.tool change light. I added the ability to my MCP server to be able to change that light. And if you, uh, run, you run the inspector, right? MPX model context uh, protocol inspector, it will go ahead and will spin up a server and I can actually go and see my light here, right? So, so uh, I've got this server uh, that's running. Uh, I can run it locally, but I also can run that uh, on, I can run that locally if I wanted to, but I could also grab my URL and I can hit the actual server version of this. So I'm gonna do that. I'm just gonna make sure my MCP server is working. I'm gonna go uh, to the end of this here and do MCP. This is the official tool uh, that comes out. So I'm just gonna go ahead and connect to this. I'm gonna list the tools and you'll see that I've got uh, in here, I've got this ability to change light, which I'm gonna try that. I'm gonna do a hex color. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, call this uh, API. It's gonna go ahead and uh, you'll see that I turned my light green, right? So my light's green now, uh, which is cool. That's cool that that's available. But now I also have the ability to do this across English, right? So I have this MCP server. Now I also have a very nice, uh, you'll see here I have this agent uh, that is available uh, as well. Oh, oh, one thing to remember that we have also, uh, we have this uh, support for X402. So if you're dealing with uh, wanting to charge things, this is a great place to go. I'll put notes to this in the in the repo as well. So the AI chat agent here, right? I could talk. I could talk with this thing. It comes out of the box. This is the starter kit uh, for that. And let me just show you really quick uh, how how awesome this is. So I can take uh, uh, what, what's in, in the server here and I look for my MCP. All I needed to do was add that MCP server and now my little chatbot that comes out of the box, you're gonna have this working real time, uh, it syncs its state across multiple browsers. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna say change the light color to be what, what it feels like to win a hackathon. We're gonna see it's gonna call the tool. I guess it's FFD 700 is what it feels like. Uh, of, oh, it's a trophy. It made the trophy color. So congratulations on uh, winning that hackathon. If you need uh, notes to where all this stuff is, there is a URL shortener called shorty.dev, <laughs> without the O, shorty without the O, dot dev, slash hack agents. There's the QR code. Thank you uh, for, for building on Cloudflare. I can't wait to see how how much you build and how fun it's going to be. I can't wait to hear about it. Uh, let us know, keep us posted. Thanks for hanging out and we'll see you real soon.